My apologies, but I get the feeling that this video is going to be pretty boring. I'm here largely just to re-explore the library now with my double jump abilities. So, yay! That looks like it should be destructible, but it's not, I guess. Oh, you things again! That's right. Literature should die. Okay, I think I can get over here now because of this. Yes! Okay, new areas to explore. A uh, corpse weed. That's uh, quite morbid. Sounds like the pubic hair on a dead body. Ugh. Oh, yay, save point. Um, but, uh, stop being stupid. Okay, yes, I do want to overwrite data. No sense in uh, overclogging my virtual memory card. Pakum! You know, everything in Japanese has really silly st uh, sound effects that they spell with katakana. And we in the Western world, when we hear that, we're thinking, what? That's what that sound is supposed to be? Oh, um... Yeah, so the... Yeah, the, the sword is quite strong. Um, the reach is not very good, and it's slower than the balisard, so I'm going to keep using it for a little bit. Hmm. Yeah, there's supposed to be a bunch of new areas I can get to now with the double jump. Where would these areas be? Yeah. This video is going to be quite boring. This is going to basically be me doing a bunch of backtracking. Yay. Fun. Has been a while since I visited the library, though. I should have come here... I don't know if I'd come here more often, because with the amount of money and equipment that I've gotten, it seems like I just got marginal upgrades. I did notice that that one uh, spell scroll I found gave me a new spell. Let me see if I can pull it off. It's hard to do. You have to go left, right, up, down. There we go. Yeah. And that summons a spell. A evil spirit would attack your enemies, I suppose. It uh, costs less MP than uh, Dark Metamorphosis does, so I'm not sure of its effectiveness. And it's a complicated thing to pull off, too, and it's, I'm kind of wondering whether it's worth it in combat conditions. Oh, that is actually kind of useful. Okay, let's try it again. Alright, take care of these books for me. I don't like to read. Now, these things have just excessively... Everything in this game has excessively interesting death animations. It's like you kill a 1 MP enemy, and then you get a Mega Man X explosion sequence out of it. Oh, that's right. I'm too tough for you bitches now. And again, if you hit me once, I'll still get cursed, so I better be careful. This is another fun part about the Metroidvania style game, is coming back to areas that you've re uh, revisited or visited in the past, and being just excessively compo uh, powerful compared to all your enemies. Yeah, I'm not seeing all these new areas that I'm supposed to be able to visit. Um, perhaps the double jump is not as fortuitous as I was led to believe. Be accessible! Ugh. Stupid Fleeman. It makes me wonder, when you're using the word man in uh, plural when you're referring to the names of monsters, is it appropriate to use the irregular plural form, like flea men as, as opposed to flea mans? Hmm. Nothing new whatsoever. This, I think, is right below... Yeah, this is... Oh, this is Librarian's shit tube. That's what that is. He poops down that thing or something. I don't know. Yeah, I can't see what new is there for me. Alright, let me see. Um, I'm going to go back through the areas that you just saw off camera and see if I can find anything new that uh, has been hitherto unaccessible. There are apparently a lot of destructible walls in this game. So I was just randomly uh, uh, wandering around the clock tower area trying to find newly accessible spots and I see a destructible door. And what's in here? Healing mail. That sounds intriguing. All right. Let's see. Diamond pipe. Blah, 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 blah. Restore. Oof. My defense goes way down, but it does heal me as I move. Let's let's use it for a bit and see how it works. Heal while walking. All right. I guess at this point I've loosely determined that there's no going to be no extra, um, no new spots of the clock tower to explore as of yet. So I may as well just uh, find the teleport point and get on my merry way. I don't see my health going up, but I'm not at maximum health. How long does it take to recover a single hit point here? Oh, this may not, may not be worth it, especially like during boss fights or what. But it might be nice to like temporarily equip this in between battles in order to heal myself. Oh yeah, that takes entirely too long. Yeah, that's only going to be useful in between just letting my health go up naturally while I'm walking around. And it's not going to be at all useful during battles. See, is the teleport point near here? I hope so. I want to see if I can find my way back. Yeah, I think I'm near it. It's right below me. Um, so it's come to my attention 
that I suck and I don't know anything. But, um... What? Have I been here? Yeah, I think there was something right here, wasn't there? Okay, yeah. Um, I still have to wander around because I don't know what new areas there are to explore. But if I find a breakable wall or something, I'll be sure to get that on camera. Oh boy, exciting. God, I am such an enormous idiot! Um, okay, so I'm back in the library again, just on a random exploration whim, and the save point which I found up here, which was accessible just by the double jump in the library, there's another exit over on the left-hand side of the room, and I didn't even notice it, and... God, I'm so stupid sometimes. Okay, whatever. Let's just fight new enemies. Oh, no, I don't want to be in wolf form. Just kill things. That's cool, yeah. Flea armor. You guys are getting silly now, aren't you? Good thing these enemies are weak, otherwise my healing armor... Yeah, you know what? The healing armor is just not worth it. I'm going to put back on the silver plate. Which was the strongest here? Was it mirror... Wait, what was this? The diamond plate. That was the strongest one. Okay, I gotcha. I'm going to keep that one on. I'll lose less net health with this thing as opposed to having that really, really slow healing effect. Alright, so now we got some new places. This is good. You know, I am not appreciative of you. Hmm. These flea men are annoying. I'm killing off their armor it gives me some good experience. Other than the experience of, experience of being hacked at by very, very small blades. Yeah, the Balasard may be a more appropriate here. I'm going to hang on to the Damascus Sword for a little bit longer. Ow. Oh. Why do I think I can reach that? I feel like I can reach that. Ow. Oh. Just outside of my grasp. Oh. Stupid, irritating little piece of map design. Oh. I'm going to annex you at the next UN conference. So, can I do the kick jump here and maybe get, a, like, a boost off these dudes? I'll try that later. Let's just explore the areas that are more easily accessible to me for now. Whoa, if you guys were hitting me for more than one HP, I would really hate you. Oh, yay. A boss. Ooh, you have laser cannons. That's odd oddly progressive for medieval demons. Even have the classic uh, laser cannon sound effect. Ooh, ah, we'll do that. You summoned something. That's awesome. I'm proud of you. I love it when my bosses are getting stronger as we go along. That was ridiculously easy. <laughs> I didn't know his pattern at all. I wasn't even trying all that hard. That wasn't hard at all. Okay, let's just save just in case. All right. Moving on, moving on, moving on. Wee. Ooh. Wee-hee-hee-hee-hee-hee-hee-hee-hee-hee-hee-hee-hee-hee-hee-hee-hee-hee-hee-hee-hee-hee-hee-hee-hee-hee-hee-hee-hee-hee-hee-hee-hee-
it, yay for increased mobility. Hot tits on sandwiches. Oh. But the sad thing is because of all my stupid, useless, dumb, disgusting, confounding, unnecessary backtracking. Oh yeah, that's going to help me get some a couple of items in the clock tower too, isn't it? Um, we're now out of time. Okay, so let me pause here and we'll be back shortly. <laughs>